Hey everyone, we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tinger, and I am playing some Mass Effect. I found a Benezia. You do not know the privilege of being a mother. There is power in creation. To shape a life, turn it toward happiness or despair. Her children were to be ours, raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies. How about we don't, Benezia? How about you have stop you being crazy? Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Nope, but I'm you going to. Humans have. I guess you want to negotiate. There's obviously no peaceful way to settle this. Indeed. I probably should have brought Liara, shouldn't I? Hey! Great, commandos! Great, boss fight! Great, fuck. Hello? Bye, right, please. Whoa! Holy balls! And I'm dead. And I'm dead. Of course I'm dead. Let's try this again. Oh, well, good thing I decided to save there, right? This is going to end poorly. I foresee this ending extremely poorly. Okay, then. Let's try it again. As soon as the game loads. Come on, game. There you go, that's better. Wait, wrong way. I'm in. Hi, Benezia. You do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guess you want to negotiate. And stasis. Of course I was. Why doesn't she just clock me in the forehead with a pistol, like, right there and there? Time to fight the commandos. I don't like you. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, I saw that, I saw that, I saw that, I saw that, I saw that. So we need to stay away from Venezia, good to know. Got me. Come on, guys! Okay, as long as you stay in the corners and out of her sight, should be okay. No, Giff! How could you open doors like that? It's not very nice. Okay, I need this. Oh, good thing I used that in time. Now is always the time. Singularity. I don't like you. I'm crab walking. Why am I crab walking? Do not like you. Have this. Gosh darn it! <laughs> Please die. Thank you. Okay. We don't have to worry about this sniper. I do, however, need to find Benazia. There she is. Yes, yeah, there for me! Well, balls! At least that doesn't seem to hurt me. I'm about to die! And dead. I don't know what she did, but I died. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, I think I did it, guys. I forgot that you're not supposed to actually directly attack Benizia. So we're either going to. Okay, saving data. Okay. This is not over. Saren is unstoppable. My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. Um, this is when I should probably have Liara with me, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, I seem to disagree. The Rachni didn't cooperate with you. Why should I? I will not betray him. You will. You... 
You must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compassion. Benezia's back! Briefly, Good Benezia. But the indoctrination is strong. Why should I believe Why you? Why are you able to break free of his control now? <coughs> I sealed a part of my mind away from the indoctrination. Saving it How for a moment did she when do I could this? help destroy him. It will not last long. Mad attack again? So you could turn on me again. Yes, but it would not be my will, Shepard. People are not themselves around Saren. You come to idolize him, worship him. You would do anything for him. The key is Sovereign, his flagship. So, yep, it the is ship a dreadnought of incredible size, and its power is extraordinary. It's a Reaper! The ship that attacked Eden Prime? I didn't think anything that size could land on a planet. It has a very powerful mass Why effect size drive, stop it but from that landing? is not Sovereign's true power. The longer you stay aboard, the more Saren's will seems correct. You sit at his feet and smile as his words pour into you. It is subtle at first. I thought I was strong enough to resist. Instead, I became a willing tool, puppet. eager to serve. Yep. He sent me here to find the location of the Mu Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. Of course it was. How do you lose How a relay? How does something that big go missing? 4,000 years ago, a star nearby went supernova. The shockwave propelled the relay out of its system, but did not damage it. Its precise vector How do you and propel speed it out without damaging it? to determine. As millennia passed, the nebula created by the nova enveloped the relay. It is difficult to find any cold object in interstellar space, particularly something swathed in uh -huh, hot dust. So and if I'd gone to Vermeer, I would have had to come here to figure out where the Mu Relay is anyway. Okay, so we couldn't skip this. How does something that big? Oh wait, go I just did this one, didn't I? It is difficult to find any cold object in interstellar space, particularly something swathed in hot dust and radiation. Someone on Novaria found it. Two thousand years ago. The Rachni inhabited that region of our galaxy. They discovered the relay. The Rachni can share memories across generations. Aha, uh -huh. so he wants the knowledge of their her mothers. memories. I took the location of the relay from the Queen's mind. I was not gentle. Oh. How did the Rachni find it? They searched patiently. They are territorial creatures, driven to close any possible way into their systems. Why does Saren so need to close relay? the relay? He believes it will lead him to the conduit. I would tell you more if I could, but Saren did not share his counsel with me. I was merely a servant to his cause. You regret your actions. You can still make it right. Give me the information. I was not myself, but I should have been stronger. I transcribed and now she's going to, to attack me, isn't she? Take it, please. Sap her in the face. Knowing the relay's coordinates isn't enough. We need to know where to go from there. So Saren wouldn't tell me his destination. But you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. Of course you did. You have we're to never stop in time. me. I, I can't. His teeth are up my ear. Fingers on my spine. You should. You should. Oh, you should. Die. Great. Take him out. Run away. Now, what do you mean, not now? Ah. Oops. I didn't do it. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Um, um, bro? Shields disabled. Wait a minute. No, 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 I'm not dying Daddy here. Not happening. Not after all that, bullocks. Goodbye, Miss Commandos. Venezia! Try, Venezia, die! Um, warp? Okay, now she's dead. <laughs> Just throw a I cannot her. go on. You will have to <coughs> stop him, Shepard. Stay with Hold us. Hold on. We've got Metagel. Maybe we can. No. He is still in my mind. 
I am not entirely myself. I never will be again. We really should have brought Liara, shouldn't I? No light. They always said there would be a... <sighs> So we're going to have to explain this to Liara. Oops. Ooh, I want this. No, I want that box. Gosh darn it, Nappa. Hey, look, it's a Rachni Queen. Uh, hmm, what do we do with you? Oh, no. It's a commando. Gonna shoot me in the back. I want your brains. Hi there. <laughs> this one serves as our voice. We That's creeper. cannot sing. Not in these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. Colorless? Uh, I don't understand you. Musics? What? Your way of communicating is strange. Flat. It does not color the air. When we speak, one moves all. We are the mother. We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silenced. Sorry! We I killed them all. Rachni. How are you speaking through her? Our kind sing through touchings of thought. We pluck the strings, and the other understands. She is weak to urging. She has colors we have no names for. But she is ending. Her music is bittersweet. It is beautiful. You are not in harmony She's with those dying. who hope to control us. And or dead. What will you sing? Will you release us? Are we to fade away once more? The Rachni were a threat to the galaxy. Those tanks are filled with acid. If she gets out of hand, they dissolve her. She's the last of her race, Shepard. We don't have the objectivity to judge her. Your Got a point there. companions hear the truth. You have the power to free us or return our people to the silence of memory. What are your plans? If I let you live, would you attack other races again? No. We. I. Do not know what happened in the war. We only heard discordance. Songs the color of oily shadows. We would seek a hidden place to teach our children harmony. If they understand, perhaps we would return. You could have calmed them if I hadn't set off the purge? No. Our minds are not as yours. Great! We can so only I did learn the right to thing? sing in harmony. Without a mother, Children are lost to silence. You should not sing of them in gray and violet. We would gray have and violet? ourselves. Are you a survivor from the war? A clone? We do not know. We were only an egg, hearing mother cry in our dreams. A tone from space hushed one voice after another. It forced the singers to resonate with its own sour yellow note. Then we awoke in the this place. The is weird! The last echo of those who came out from the singing planet. The sky is silent. I won't kill you. <coughs> destroy your entire race. You'll go free. I was like, I don't really have the right to you destroy an entire race. the chance to compose anew? Yes. We will remember. We will sing of your forgiveness to our children. Okay, bye bye, Miss Rock Night Queen. 
I'm not gonna kill your face. Unless it gets you incredibly useful in Mass Effect 3. And because, honestly, I don't have the right to murder an entire, like, cause the extinction of an entire species. I don't have that right. At least that's my thoughts on it. Yay, all the Paragon- how Paragon am I now? So Paragon! <laughs> More armor. Yes. More... Armor? More shields. Or, well, more pistols, so I can give you some shotgun later, but... Is this the right way? I'm going to pretend that it is. Oh, hey! It is the right way! Yay, now let's get the hell out of Dodge. So, we have Vermeer to do, the DLC to do, and a bunch of extra planets and side quests to do. <coughs> so, hopefully, it won't take us too long. Also, it's going to take me forever to walk all the way back to the station, to no the Novaria place, all the way back to the frickin' Normandy. Ah, why? Why can't I just say, do you want to return to the Normandy? <laughs> Your quest here is done. No, it wouldn't say that, because that would make sense. Loading. 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 I really should have brought Liara on that one. Oh god, I am back on the one. What's our day. next move, Commander? Head for the Mew Relay? Not so fast. The Mew Relay could link to dozens of systems. Unless we know exactly where Saren's going, we'd just be wasting our time. The Commander is right. We cannot rush off blind. We still need to learn more about Saren. Who put you in charge? Did the Commander resign when I wasn't looking? Hey! Ashley! Stop being racist! We're all on the same team here, Williams. She's just trying to help. Racist. Sorry, Commander. Racist! Racist! We're done here. Crew, dismissed. Novaria report is away, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? So racist! Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Is this report accurate, Commander? Yes. You found Rachni on Novaria? Yes, we did. You didn't release the Queen. Yes, I did. Do you have any idea what you've done? I know exactly what I'm doing. until they overrun the galaxy. They won't. This queen is different. She understands why her kind had to be wiped out last time around. I hope you're right, Shepard. Our children's children will pay the price if you're not. Oh, we'll shut your, your face, report, Turian. Commander. Turian, whatever his name was. So now let's go see what all of my, uh... Squad mates, think. Rex is going to be pissed. So pissed. Oh well. Yeah. Open the door. Thank you. Now we gotta go talk to Caden. Sorry, Caden. We are not dating. It's not happening. I'm a one alien woman. Anything you need, Commander? I give a personal input. Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Thoughts? I didn't figure you'd have time to talk with all that's going on. There's gotta be some as... biologists who want to read about the Thorian. <laughs> they can wait. Uh, probably screw it. All in triplicate, I'm sure. Did you want to see me? I'm just looking for an ear. That a briefing wasn't the right place to say how ridiculous this is. What do you mean? Like every other race in the galaxy is wrapped up in their own problems. They don't want to see what's coming. Okay, the humans are also wrapped up in their own problems because it was our colony that got attacked. So don't be saying that. We're, it's like it's like every other race because humans are so much better. Yeah, no, screw you, Caden. Okay. You can't blame them. Wanting to believe everything will be fine. Sounds like human nature to me. Yeah, I guess some things carry across species well enough. I should remember that after what happened with Vernus. What so happened? Don't tell me you and Vernus hugged on graduation day. Before I met Vernus, I knew as much as any other civilian. Aliens were weird. 
superior and <laughs> tried to tell us what to do. I mean, it's only been 26 years since first contact. That's not a lot of time to understand them. But it was Vernus who made me see how human aliens are. They're not different or special. They're jerks and saints, just like us. They're jerks and saints. <laughs> well, by the time I got payback, I didn't even want it anymore. What happened? I don't see you snapping very easily. What finally did it? He hurt Rana. Broke her arm. She reached for a glass of water instead of pulling it biotically. She just wanted a drink without getting a nosebleed. You know? Like an idiot, I stood up. Didn't know what I was gonna do. Just something. He broke her arm because she wanted some water? Lost it. Beat the crap out of me. Kept shouting how they should have bombed us back to the Stone Age. And that's when the knife came up. A military issue talon. Right in my face. I cut loose. Full biotic kick right in the teeth. Almost as strong as I can manage now. At 17, that's something. <laughs> you tried to help Rona! You wanted to help a girl you cared for. That's a noble thing. Maybe my intentions were noble, but I... I lost control. I killed him, Shepard. Ah! You broke his neck! Snapped his neck. Yep. They probably could have saved him if they got him to an infirmary quick enough. But they didn't. Caused a stir when they shipped him home. Bot training was shut down. Kinetics folded a couple of years later. So, yeah, maybe I hated that Turian. I mean, if one ass was enough to judge a whole race, I'd hate humans too. Yeah, he's got a point there. Weird stuff's going on outside my house. Fair enough. A reasonable stance. Keep that level head and we'll do fine. Staying reasonable is about all we've got left. Everyone else in this galaxy seems to have gone out of their minds. Present company, exactly including course. humans. Keep that in mind, Caden. Including humans. We're not all cherry picking roses and stuff. Hi, Chakwas. Not talk to Chakwas. Yes, Commander. Is there something you need? Not really. I should go. <clears throat> Goodbye, you have Commander. nothing special to say. Liara. I'm sorry. Sorry, I didn't take take you with me on Novaria. If you are here to talk about Benezia's death, you need not bother. She brought it upon herself. You don't feel bad? Don't pretend it doesn't bother you. She was your mother. She was. But she was not. Not anymore. I prefer to remember Benezia as she used to be. Before she was corrupted by Sovereign's power. She's still with you. The best of your mother lives on in you. Her determination, her intelligence, her strength. Her prettiness. No, it we're not dating Liara, guys. Say, it's not happening. I appreciate your concern, but I am fine. Benezia chose her path, just as I have chosen mine. I am with you until the end, Shepard. Let's talk. I like talking with you, Liara. No matter what the subject. Then let us talk about you. Why? Are you okay? I have nightmares, which You're is true. You're not sleeping well. The visions keep me up at night. I wish there was something I could do to help you. You need to be at your best, Commander. The crew relies on you for leadership. Great! Way to make it worse, Liara. Um, they're not the problem. I can handle the responsibility of command. But if you <coughs> stop Saren, the entire galaxy gets wiped out. Yep. Everybody sorry, dies. Commander. Oh. The last thing you need is someone constantly reminding you of how grim things are. Yeah, Is there Liara. anything else you would rather talk about? Um... Benezia? Do you know why Benezia joined up with Saren? Benezia was swept up in events beyond her control and lost herself. She fell under the spell of indoctrination and became part of the very thing she wanted to stop. But I will remember and honor how she lived, Aww. not how she died. Yeah, My your mother mommy's was dead. Strong, so dead. Kind and beautiful. And now she is gone. Sorry. Are you gonna be okay? You are kind to ask, Shepard. I do miss her. I grieve for what happened to her, but I will not let my grief interfere with what we are trying to accomplish. Okay, bye, Liara. Go. Goodbye, Commander. I'm gonna go talk to everybody else, too. Because I need to get everybody's opinion. Yay, then we'll go do a whole bunch of extra side missions. Yay! <laughs> I could just go straight to Vermeer and finish the game, but I want to get as much things done as possible, so we can have as many things to do in Mass Effect 2 as possible, so we can have as many things as possible to do in Mass Effect 3. 
Okay. Hi, Rex. We need to have a discussion. What do you want, Shepard? Why did you become a mercenary? Lots of reasons. Wait, he has nothing to say about the Rachni? He tries to, he almost attacks you when you try and set them free. Such as? Such as. I needed to get out of our system. I needed to eat. I needed to survive. Why leave? Why not stay and help your people? I tried to help. That's why I had to leave. Really? What happened? I was betrayed. I was head of a small tribe. We were trying to restore order after the war. But the other tribes were against us. They followed Jared, one of the few warlords who survived the war with the Turians. But he was old. And so were his ideas. That everybody he should be warmongering. War. Yep. He wanted us to fight. Turians, Salarians, each other. It didn't matter who, as long as we were fighting. And what about you? What did you want? I just wanted Jared to shut up. Ha! <laughs> That's stop a good enough reason. His ranting. I wanted him to stop leading the tribes astray. But he couldn't understand how much things had changed. We didn't have the numbers to go to war. Even if we did, the Genophage made sure we couldn't replenish our numbers fast enough. I told them all to forget about war. We needed to focus on breeding. Yes, what well, he said. one generation. And for a while, we were getting through. Some of the tribes started coming around. I take it the Warlord didn't appreciate that. Probably not. No, he didn't. He arranged a crush with the tribes. A meeting on neutral ground. He wanted to talk. Except Within he totally didn't, homes, right? Near the graves of our ancestors. The skulls of our dead laid bare to remind us where we come from. And where we all go. It's as sacred as any Krogan place can be. Violence is forbidden. And that's exactly what happened, isn't it? Sounds like a trap to me. Lots of violence. You must have suspected as much. I did. But when your father invites you to a crush, well, there are some laws that even we hold. Jared safe. was your father? Jared was your father? He was. Until that day. We talked. But we didn't get anywhere. When it was clear that I wouldn't join him, he gave the signal. His men leapt from the graves of our ancestors like Krogan undead. The few that were loyal to me died quickly. That's probably how he got his scars, isn't I it? escaped with my life, but not before I sank my dagger deep into my father's chest. That is why I left, and that's why I'll never go back. Tell that to Mass Effect 2 and Mass Effect 3 when you're totally the leader of the Krogan. Are you people really dying? We're sure not getting any Wait, no, I've already asked them this spread one. spread out. Family. None of us are interested in you staying You must have family other than your father. Don't you miss them? You're trying to make me cry, Shepard. No. I've got some... Is it working? ...unfinished business with my family. But that's all. Really? What kind of business? Before I left, I made an oath to my father's father. His grandfather. I swore to recover my family's battle armor. It was taken from him after the uprising. Where is it? Who has it? Originally, it was taken by the Turian military. We weren't allowed armor or weapons after the war. Now, it's in the hands of Ton Actus, a Turian scum who collects relics from the war. So He's we need to go kill him, right? Selling Krogan artifacts that were stolen from my people. He's got several bases where he stores his goods, all fortified and guarded. I just don't know which base has my family's armor. I'll look for it. Just tell me where to start looking. 
I'll upload the data to your nav system. But Commander, I want to be there when you find him. I make no so promises, let's... but I will try. Shepard. We already ballsed up and didn't take Liara. Commander? Uh, can we talk? Do you have a few minutes to talk? Can we talk, Miss Racist? Sure, if you have time. Figured you'd be busy with tactical briefings and whatnot. Don't know what I think about us attacking today, of all days. Kind of an ill omen. We're not attacking today! I've got like 50,000 other things to do! They're gonna take more than a day. You mean on the anniversary of the first contact war? The end of it, yeah. My family always marks it. I'm the only Williams here. I guess you'd be the only other one interested in it. Seems like an odd thing to celebrate. That was 26 years ago. <coughs> in our family, it's not really a celebration, more like an obligation. Don't tell me you don't know about my family. My well, family I do, but does me in the game It's not my files or something? There's almost nothing in your files. Technical scores and a list of crap assignments. There's a reason for the crap assignments. I'm General Williams' granddaughter, the commander of the Shanxi garrison in the war. The only human ever to surrender to an alien race. Ah, not your fault. Don't tell me you're blamed for that. Not formally. Dad got passed for promotion over and over. And I think my record merits more than garrison duty in a backwater agri-colony. Takes a special kind of thick-headed to march into a job where your family's blacklisted. I did it anyway. I'm not gonna let our name go down with Arnold and Quisling. Granddad deserved better than that. With Arnold and Quiz, I don't know either of those names. What I probably your should. Grandfather after the war, he was relieved of command <coughs> as soon as Shan Shi was liberated. They brought him back to Earth in irons, but there was never a trial. They quietly demoted him and stuck him behind a desk. He retired a year later and spent the rest of his life working construction in the colonies. Sometimes we hear about attempts to get him exonerated in some official way. Nothing ever comes of him. Well, we'll finish talking to Ashley in the next video because I completely didn't notice that I've gone over time. My name is Miss Carrington, and I hope you're I'll see you all.